Hello and welcome to Quick Tips, the WooCommerce video series. In this video, we are going to install the free WooCommerce order and shipment tracking plugin. This plugin will help your customer to see the status of the shipment in the order page. Let me show you the example. Here I'm logged in as a customer and here I can see all my orders. Here I can see the option to track the shipment position, the status of the order. So if I click on it, it will go directly to the shipment company website along with the tracking code. So here I can see the status of the shipment. Now this is the dashboard of the admin and I can enter the tracking code, the carrier name, the pickup date and I can update it here and the customer will see all the details automatically on the orders page. The customer will also receive an email along with the tracking and shipment details. Now here is the list of carriers that you can select. There are around 480 plus carriers and shipping. I do have the premium version of this plugin. So I'm going to install the premium version also. And I'll show you what is the difference between the free plugin and the premium version of this plugin. So let's see how does this work. Do not forget to subscribe to Quick Tips YouTube channel. Watch new videos about website design, e-commerce websites, search engine optimization, social media marketing, WordPress tutorials, video editing tips, and many more. Press the bell icon to get instant notification whenever we publish new videos. So I'm logged into the dashboard of the WordPress website and we are using WooCommerce on this dummy website. Now we are going to install the free WooCommerce order and shipment tracking plugin. So let's go to plugins and click on add new. Here search for WooCommerce order and shipment tracking. So we are looking for WooCommerce order and shipment tracking plugin. And this is the first plugin YITH WooCommerce order and shipment tracking plugin. We are going to install the free version of this plugin and we will also install the premium version of this plugin. So click on install now. Click on activate. Alright, so the plugin has been installed and here you will see the option YITH order and shipment tracking. Click on it. We will go through the general settings first. This is the general settings page. With this free version of the plugin, you will not get any option to choose the carrier, the shipping company. If I go to carrier, you will see that there are many carrier companies. There are many shipping companies listed. However, you will not be able to set up the default carrier company because that is the option for the premium version only. So here you can enter the shipment company or the carrier company manually. So go back to general options and here I'm going to set up the default carrier and I'm going to name it as Param. This is just the name of the company Param Shipping. And this will be the text to show in the order details page. So whenever someone places the order, they will receive the information about the carrier company also. Your order has been picked up by this, this company this day. And this is the tracking code. So the customer will also get the information about their shipment and the order tracking code. They will see the order tracking code on their orders page as well as they will receive the email with the details. Now this is where you want to show the text order details page top before the product list or bottom after the product list. I'm going to set it as it is top and let's click on save options. Now let's go to the orders. We will see how does this work on the actual order page. So I'm going to edit this order. So we are on the details of the order page. And these are the order details. And here you will see the option order tracking. So whenever you want to enable this order tracking, you can simply select yes. And here you can enter the tracking code. So I'm going to enter some dummy tracking code here. Carrier name, whatever your shipping company is, you can enter that name here. Pick up date. So you can select the date. Let me select today's date. And here you can enter the website of the carrier company here i'm going to use my website domain so this is just an example you have got the tracking code the carrier name date and website of the carrier so i'm going to update it right now let's go back to orders so now when i go to orders i can see the truck icon here and i can see the details of the carrier or the shipping 
picked up by this company on date and this is the tracking code and this is the website so this is on the admin side now i'm going to log in as a customer in a different browser so i have opened the same website and i'm logged in as a customer here and i can see my order details here now let me refresh it now when i refresh it i can see this order tracking details so this is what we have here on the admin side and for the customer side you, you can see the tracking details the same tracking details are there your order has been picked up by this company on this date and this is the tracking code so if i click on it it will go to the website of that company and they can track the order from that company website so this is how the free version works now let me install the premium version of this plugin so let's go to plugins and click on add new there are some added features in the pro version i'll show you let me show you the details of the pro version here so this is the pro version plugin yith woocommerce order and shipment tracking and the price of this plugin is 65 dollars and 99 cents there is a 10 percent discount or 13 percent discount going on i'll give you the link in the description box if you need you can buy this pro plugin and use my link in the description box here you can see the details of this plugin here you can see the difference between the free and the premium one so in the premium you will get 480 plus carriers supported to automatically get the tracking url so it will get the tracking url the link automatically save the time by importing tracking csv file you can also enter the estimated date of delivery in the details so these are the features i'll give you the link you can check the details if required you can go with the pro version so let me upload the pro version of this plugin install it click on activate all right so the plugin has been activated here you will see yith again click on order tracking and now you will see the dashboard of the pro version go to carriers here you will see the list of carriers that you can use check carriers that will be used for order shipping if you shouldn't find your favorite carrier in the list please open a ticket and our support team will be glad to add it as soon as possible so if you do not see you can open a ticket and they will add your favorite carrier in the list so let's see what carriers i can see here so in india i can see blue dart i have already checked it also you can see dhl is there dtdc is another indian courier that i can use so according to your country you will see different carriers that you can set up that you can choose from you just need to find your carrier here or select the carrier and click on save options ups is also there you can see the ups option all right so i have selected three so i'm going back to the general tab now here you can select the default carrier so i'm going to select blue dart or let's select dtdc complete order it says choose if you want to automatically set the order status to complete it when the order is set as picked up okay so i'm not going to select this one i'm going to leave it as it is this is the text in the orders page your order has been picked up by this 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 and this is the tracking code same what we saw here text in the email so this is the text in the email that customer will receive where do you want to show on the top show in the packing list if you are using packing list then it will be shown on the packing list also and if you have csv of the tracking codes you can import that also so i'm going to save the options here now let's go back to woocommerce and go to orders now let's go back to the same order again so this is the tracking code that i have used and this is the postcode it is optional not necessary now here you can select the courier so i'm going to select dtdc here and this is the pickup date that i have already selected and this is this will be marked as order picked up click on update now the 
email will be sent to the customer. Let's go back to the website where I'm logged in as a customer. Let me refresh it. And here you can see the truck icon has been changed. Slightly smaller one. If I click on it, it will go directly to the company. Okay, I'm getting some error here, the security error. So I'm going to change it. I can do that. I can simply click on track and send anyway. It will go with that shipping code number. So let me see if I select. So I'm going to select a DHL and update it. Let me refresh it. And if I click on it, it will go to the DHL website along with the tracking code. So this is the wrong code. That's why it's not showing anything. However, if you have the correct tracking code, it will go directly to the DHL website along with the tracking code. And it will show the status of your product, whether it is picked up, whether it is on the way. So there are some different features added to the pro version. If you want to get additional features, then you can definitely go with the pro version. If you think you can work with the free version, then you can keep on working with the free version. Free version is also good. You just need to enter the tracking code, the website link and the carrier name manually in case of free version. So this is how you can set up order and shipment tracking in your WooCommerce website. So that's it for now. See you in the next video. Do not forget to subscribe to my channel to get more quick tips about online softwares and tools. If you have any questions, please leave us message in comments section and press the like button if you like the video. Thanks for watching quick tips.